The Nikon 2025 lineup is drawing attention with its promise of significant updates and new features. With advancements like high-speed sensors and enhanced stabilization, photographers are keen to see how these changes will improve their gear. Here is the upcoming Nikon lineup that you should definitely keep an eye on in 2025. Nikon Z90 It looks like the Nikon Z90 could be the next big addition to Nikon's DX format lineup, offering a step up from the Z50. Word is, a prototype featuring a 33 megapixels APS-C sensor has been spotted, which means you can expect top-notch image quality. If video is more your thing, the Z90 is rumored to support 4K at 60fps, making it great for capturing crisp and smooth footage. Within body image stabilization IBIS, steady shots are possible even without a tripod. Plus, it might boast an impressive 20fps raw burst mode, allowing up to 1000 frames in one go, perfect for capturing fast action. Speculation suggests we could see an official announcement as soon as August or September 2024. If all these features pan out, the Z90 is set to be an exciting addition to Nikon's mirrorless lineup. Nikon Z9H Next, Nikon is preparing a high-speed version of the Z9, potentially called the Z9H, designed to compete with powerhouses like the Canon Roan, R3, and Sony A93. According to recent info, Nikon is working on a 20.4-megapixel sensor that boasts an impressive readout speed of just 0.4 milliseconds. This means ultra-fast performance, perfect for action and sports photographers. What's even more exciting is that the sensor can synchronize with a flash at speeds of up to 1, 2000 sec, allowing for incredible precision in high-speed shooting. The prototype is said to be close to hitting the production line, featuring a dual Xspeed 7 processor, which may come as a surprise given that the Xspeed 8 is already available. We're not sure what the final model name will be, but rumors suggest the release could be around late 2024 or early 2025. If all these details come together, the Z9H is set to be a serious contender in the high-speed camera market. Nikon Z5 II The Nikon Z5 launched back in 2020, is due for an upgrade, and with Nikon admitting it has underserved first-time buyers, the Z5 II could be their chance to make things right. The Z5 II will likely stick to what made the original popular, keeping the 24-megapixel CMOS sensor and the reliable 5-stop in body image stabilization. IBIS, however, it probably won't get the higher-end features like a BSI sensor or the newer 8-stop IBIS to keep costs down, making it more budget-friendly. Video capabilities are expected to stay the same, offering 4K at 30p, which should still appeal to entry-level creators. One feature that has been a bit surprising is the dual-card slots, unusual for an entry-level camera. While there's speculation Nikon could remove a slot in the Z5 II to reduce cost and size, it might come at the risk of alienating some fans. Either way, with competition from Sony and Canon, Nikon will have to strike a balance between keeping costs low and offering enough features to stand out. Nikon Z9 II Moving on, the Nikon Z9 II is shaping up to be a high-speed powerhouse, featuring a 20.4-megapixel sensor with a readout speed of just 0.4 milliseconds. One of the most exciting rumors is the potential introduction of a global shutter, which would eliminate the distortion caused by rolling shutters when shooting fast-moving subjects. This feature could be a game-changer for sports, wildlife, and action photographers who need precision and clarity in every shot. Another standout rumor is its impressive flash synchronization speed of up to 1, 2000 th of a second, making it a serious contender for studio and fashion photographers who rely on flash. The ability to sync at such high speeds would set the Z9 II apart from most cameras on the market today. In terms of processing power, the Z9 II is expected to pack dual Xspeed 7 processors, even though Nikon is already testing the newer Xspeed 8. This dual-processor setup promises lightning-fast performance, ideal for continuous shooting and smooth 4K video. With a possible release around late 2024 or early 2025, 
This could be one of Nikon's most impressive releases yet. Nikon ZS Now take a look at the Nikon ZS, blending classic design with modern technology. Rangefinders, known for their manual focusing and optical viewfinders, have long been cherished for their compact size and discreet operation, making them a favorite among street photographers and photojournalists. The ZS is rumored to feature a full-frame sensor and Nikon's Z-mount, offering high image quality and access to a broad range of lenses. It's expected to retain the tactile experience of traditional rangefinders while incorporating digital conveniences like in-body image stabilization and high-resolution electronic viewfinders. If these details hold true, the ZS could appeal to both enthusiasts of classic rangefinders and modern photographers looking for a unique shooting experience. Nikon Z52 On the other hand, the Nikon Z52 is on the horizon promising an updated body design and improved features over its predecessor. The new model will be powered by the Xpeed 7 processor, enhancing performance and speed. It's also set to include a flippy screen similar to the one on the Z63, offering more flexibility for vlogging and creative shots. USB-C connectivity will make data transfer and charging more convenient. The Z52 will use the same Nikon NL25 battery as the original Z50, ensuring compatibility with existing accessories. While the 20.9 MPDX format CMOS sensor from the Z50 is expected to carry over, there's hope that Nikon might introduce a new sensor, especially given competitors like Fuji are using higher resolution sensors in their recent models. Notably, there will be no battery grip available for the Z52. The camera will also support the new Nikon Imaging Cloud, enhancing its connectivity and integration with Nikon's ecosystem. An official announcement is anticipated before the end of 2024. Nikon Z73 Lastly, the upcoming Nikon Z73 is set to build on the foundation of its predecessor with some key updates. While the resolution is expected to stay at 45.7 MP, similar to the Z72, the major improvement will likely be in the sensor's construction. The Z73 is anticipated to feature a partially stacked sensor, enhancing shooting speeds and balancing performance without the fully stacked technology seen in the Z8 and Z9. This design aims to offer a competitive edge while maintaining efficiency. The Z73 will probably skip the pixel shift multi-shot mode available in the Zeit, which creates 180 MP images by shifting the sensor. Instead, it will focus on refining its core high-resolution stills capabilities. Video-wise, it might forego 8K recording in favor of introducing 6K options, catering to users seeking strong video performance without going all-in on 8K. Image stabilization is expected to get a boost, potentially offering up to 8 stops of compensation, and the Focus Point VR system might be integrated for improved precision. While some rumors suggest an 88-megapixel sensor, this seems unlikely given Nikon's typical product positioning and cost considerations. That was our top pick for the 7 best Nikon models to watch in 2025. We hope you found the video helpful thanks for watching.